This video is to show you how to save your parameters on a Fanuc Zero TC control uh, to your laptop or to a PC using your RS-232 port. I need, of course, a PC, some software to up and download a cable to save it with. So the first thing you have to do is get to your setting page and make sure your settings are proper in your parameter area. So ISO should be at one and IO is at zero. You also have to have your mode key and edit. And if there is an edit key or memory protect, make sure it's uh, off so you can send your information. Next thing you have to do is make sure you have your software and prepare it to receive the file. So open this up, receive from the CNC. Now it's waiting. So on the Fnook Zero TC, you must be in the parameter page. And to save options, you must hold end of block and press output start. You'll get an output signal down here that's showing it's going. On your PC, I see it scrolling down and it's saving the parameters. Take a few seconds. If you don't hold the end of block before you press output start, you will not save your 900 option parameters. And this will you not find in the Fanuc manual. So that's a little secret that uh, Fanuc has. So that's finished. So you can save it to a file or whatever. Call it something, parameter, and save it. So now, Same thing with diagnostics. Get it ready to receive, and it's waiting. Press the diagnostic key so you're in diagnostics, and then press output start. You get the output signal, and you'll see your information scrolling down. That's finished. And then your output signal's off. Now the couple signals or uh, information you need to say or look at, and that is um, your stop bits. Uh, two bit zero is set for one, and that equals two stop bits. Parameter 552 and 553 is your baud rate. And that's set for 10, which equals 4800. So on your PC, you have to have those settings to match or it won't go through. 
Okay, that is it.